Hi everybody, how we got it here for Boston Lock Tech. And here's your host, Gus Greenfield. Hey everybody, on a more serious note, I just want to get through this stuff real quick. I don't know if I showed you guys, I, I showed you guys these in another video. This top one is like a lime green one. It was like a, like a little spot right there on the, that wasn't actually on the car. It's, that's on the package. So it's like, sort of goes with it. Not that. Oh, man, like, no, no, now it's like freaking out. I think it jumps, it jumps off. It jumps off the plastic and then jumps on the car. It's like some kind of a, something. There we go. See, it disappeared there. And that's the one that I was showing had, uh, like, the sparklies on the bottom inside the, the thing. And then, um, so, and, and that's like a lime green one and a yellow. First edition, both of them, same exact numbers, everything. And then this one here, if you guys had, didn't see the other video, these two here are both the same exact thing, first editions. Look at the tempo. Look at it close. Where's Waldo? What's missing in this picture? See the color of the tempo and the Hot Wheels insignia and on the door and how big this one is and the color and how small this one is. And it's just like, and these are the same exact first edition ones. So if you guys think they're worth a whole bunch of money or somebody's like, you know, if it's, you know, just for collectors or whatever for to get that out there so everybody knows. Um... There was like a lot of people that were like doing the, uh, the, the, on another video that I had back here, like if you look right here, this was like a um, one of four case. I think it was from 2020, 2020, uh, that I had like bad people taking, uh, what they do is they get, uh, I'm looking at some other cars down here that I didn't know. Um, what they do is like they'll they'll people will actually for one dollar toy cars They'll buy these case of these cars from Mattel or where Walmart, I don't even know where they get them, but this is what they look like factory sealed label blah 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 all this stuff And they come in a box like this Here's the box And what they'll do they'll get them they'll order them and they'll get them and they'll Open them up. They'll take the treasure hunts out and the super treasure hunts out and whatever else people were like really seeking. And then they'll replace like a basic car inside the, um, the slot of the thing. So it's like, um, if you guys want to take a look at this on, on my other one, I was like, hey, check this out. People are like actually bad people doing for one dollar toys. And, you know, we're all collectors. And you're not going to become a millionaire stealing treasure hunts out of, well, maybe you will. I mean, this is like down to a science, I guess. Uh, the thing that I put, and I posted on some of my vlogs or uh, Facebook or wherever, it's like um, nothing against old ladies at Walmart or or. or not even Walmart in general. I mean, heck, it might be somewhere, somewhere else. But um, these, when you take a, like a case back, you bought, you ordered from Target or Walmart or, or whatever, some kind of store. The people that you're returning this to was like, why don't you want this, sir? It's like, oh well, I thought it was a different case order. So the thief has already changed the cars in there, and there ain't no old woman from Walmart or wherever and i don't mean to like name different stores that that's gonna like go through these cars and see this like the exact it's like well this is, you should say this or that and, and it's like um it's just amazing that people do this you steal a car out of there you know this case here has 116 cars and it had 116 cars in it and there's probably like I don't know, maybe 14, maybe eight uh, treasure hunts or special ones. Or
or something like that. It was just amazing that people would steal like that. And then they return and get their money back. This guy here on this one, though, I got to give him credit, man. The cars that he replaced, like the basics and stuff like that, he replaced them with um, Zamac cars and um, the red cars from Target. And like so he was like just to make sure he thought like it would be something special and some of the cars in there are kind of nice it's like i actually found a couple of them was like oh i didn't even have these but like it's just terrible so i'm gonna like show you tear apart these a couple of these and show you real quick what's going on don't buy these cases online at all First thing right off the bat, if you got the cardboard box or whatever, make sure that's sealed. And if you just have this, this is actually heavy. There's honestly, this is like a waxed type thing going on here, and I'm like, it's like here you know, like showing my. Like this is, uh, I have this. I had this already started, but this was like, this was the sealed case that I showed in another video. But because it's waxed and stuff, the box, to make it nice together, they can pull that right off of there. And this one, here's another thing to look at. Uh, there's like a crease in the top. I don't think you can grab it that way. Let's see it. Maybe shine it different ways. I mean, there's a crease in the top like they pulled up the corner. Anyway... So sealed cases aren't, don't be naive. The cardboard ones are out. Okay, these are, I'm just going to make sure, these, these are like some 2020 things. Here's like, just for an example, right here. These are, see the little thing right there? It says, uh. So this is factory sealed 2020 set. And every car, here's a Zamac. They must have not wanted them. Every car in that slot, or in that sleeve, I'll call them like a cardboard sleeve, which I'm going to show you. Like, they'll have that sticker on there. Here's one. This was in the, this was in the uh, thing, which is a nice car. 2016 Ford GT Racer. It's a beautiful car, but it was in that sleeve. You see, there's no hologram sticker. Here's a 17 2017 Ford GT hologram sticker. This is a yeah. This was like actually a 50th anniversary. This one up here, but it was in this sleeve. Which, it's a good car, yeah, but I, I actually didn't have it, so I can't complain. No, but I, I am complaining. I'm not complaining. I'm, I'm sort of showing you guys what's up. Here's the, uh, what I found. And this is like the second case that I got these off of from a, a friend of mine, like, does some, gets some stuff from Walmart rejections and stuff like that. I'm like, I'm going to hold this up here. And whoever this asshole is, got this upside down. Whoever this asshole is, this is like he always has like some kind of like little notes on there. And like this, this one here was like uh, I don't know. Here, like just pause, pause that, and look at these things, so you can see what I'm talking about. That's what's in this sleeve supposed to be in this sleeve and some of these i've already taken apart other ones i i haven't yet because i know they're like so this has like the everybody's seen them the um you know it's got the tv series batmobile in there willie's jeep sidekick batmobile tv series batmobile regular batmobile formula gen 2 car alpine bow circle tracker Astana hato mod rod custom el camino rip rod landscape prototype so there's actually like nothing in this sleeve that would like matter. I don't think any of them was a treasure hunt or a super treasure hunt. Um, there's some other loose ones. 
Everybody's seen these. So I'll have the hologram on them. See the hologram sticker? Man, I can't believe we're already in like 10 minutes of this thing. It's like, this is so important. Here's one that was actually in, in a sleeve here. The seven, uh, 17 Ford GT. And everybody knows I'm a sucker for these. Um, look at that. Look at that sucker. Beautiful car. I haven't seen that one. But look. See, it don't have the hologram thing on it. And looking at the back of it, it's like... Um, this is a 2018 model. But it was in this sleeve. Replaced something on one of these sleeves. It's a beautiful car. The guy that like did this, he must have felt guilty because here's another one. Don't have it don't have the hologram sticker on there. Here's the hologram sticker. Here's the uh, fast feline hologram sticker. Every car that's in this case should have this. And here's another one of them. Look at that. Another beautiful car. But it don't have that sticker on there. Alright, so we're getting in the piece where I think this one might be one that I didn't open up, but Alright, I'm just gonna let you know uh, 20 Jeep Gladiator, Speed Driver, Armor Truck, Power Pistons, 2019 Audi R8 Spider, 19 Kia Stinger, Corvette CG2 is a Tesla Model 3. 92 Ford Mustang, 92 Ford Mustang, GHG44, GHF95. So there's two different ones. Bone Shaker, the Fast Art Roger Dodger Custom 56 Ford Mustang. And then see you see that. That's everything's in there. And you see that asshole's little thing on there. So this is like some kind of a cartel type big business thing going on to where these people were stealing this stuff and it's like um this is not the first time that i've seen this like i said here's like all these cars have the hologram and they're just all your basic cars that that we all have or have found if you need one there they all have that hologram on there so 20 case Here's some more. Here's a, a lot of people can't find this guy. And look at that guy, a surfboard guy, but there he is. He's, he's from that case. And then, here's this guy. I probably have like 30 of these. I can't, every time I see one, I buy them. But anyway, you know. Yeah, if you need any anything from the Q case or the, the later cases, I, if you need one, contact me. Five bucks plus shipping, you can have it. Here's this, uh, this is the um, eight Hot Wheels 450F Batcopter, Mega Tuner, 19 Ford Ranger Raptor, Croc Rod, Night Dragon, Turbo Rooster, Turb Bone Charge, 98 Subaru Impreza, 22B the STI version, uh, 2018 Audi RS Coupe, Range Rover Bel Air, Big Bel Air, 50. 52 Chevy, 52 Hudson Hornet, 49F1. There it is right there. If you want to pause it. And there's that asshole's initial. And like I said, and I keep repeating myself, and I'm sorry, but this is like organized because this isn't the first case that I got. But any, anyway, um, here's another one. There's this fucker's little initial there. These are like the sleeves. And there's like about 15 cars in each each sleeve. Um, 70 Dodge Power Wagon, 70... I'm trying to find one that's like, that I know is like... All right. Well, anyway, if there is a treasure hunt or a super treasure hunt or whatever on this list, it will be in here if you buy it from the, the factory, from Mattel or whatever, in that box that's that I showed you. In this box. This box... With this factory seal on it. They will be in there. And this is like four of, or this is like number three out of four cases. If you buy all four of them, 
then you'll have every car I think they made for 2020 or however that works. And it's just a terrible thing that people are actually doing this. And they're stealing, like, everything you can go through. There. If there's, like, a good one, I'm just, like, going to do a random one here. Like, say this one. Say this one was the treasure hunt. Ooh, the, uh, I mean, it might not be so, so whatever, but I'm just going to pick out a name. Uh, say the Mad Props, that airplane. That was the treasure hunt for this case and this sleeve and this thing. What they'll do is they'll take that out and they'll put some other kind of, uh, they'll put, like, a, Something, you know, maybe a Roger Dodger in there. Like a, you know, the Roger Dodger, like the, from 2020, we'll stick that in there. So there'll be, there'll actually be like 15, 14 or 15 cars in this sleeve from that case. But the cars that you're looking for, the good ones in, that are in there, that, you know, it's just, it's just a terrible terrible thing that people i mean there's enough there's enough problems when we have guys like cliff that's going to walmart and cutting open cases and stealing all the treasure hunt now we got people that are like stealing the freaking cases cases from the company taking the, the good stuff out and returning it and what i mean they're adding like basic cars into the case of where they took out the treasure hunts and stuff like that and like it probably, you know what? I bet you, it, I, pro, I bet you it is Cliff. That does kind of look like it says Cliff on there. It's either Cliff or Chuck. But I've noticed on that, and it's like I don't know if that's. It almost like that's a like beautiful signature, but yeah, there's a bunch of them. So there was people that wanted to see this, and I'm sorry, this is like got kind of long, and I didn't have enough cars on there and stuff like that for like showing everybody. But there was a lot of people from my other video that I said they said, "Well, we want to see it. What are you talking about? How how do you know that they're bad or whatever?" It's like I like gave it like a brief description, but I just wanted to like do like a make it live what I'm talking about and what you know nothing against old ladies that work at Target or Walmart or wherever these things get returned to, but. For a dollar car, little toy cars, and you got to do that, you know. I like hunting for them, finding them. Oh my gosh, look, I found two supers. I'll trade them for you guys for like, I need to, you know, what I need this one or that one. It's like, that's what it's like trading and bartering, not, not stealing. Don't steal. If, if you're stealing, man, I'm going to find you and I'm going to, and I'm going to put you on YouTube just like I did with Cliff. If you guys ever want to see any pictures of Cliff, he's not actually stealing. He's just a dick. He's just a dick. All right, this is this video is getting too long, and I haven't even really showed you guys any cars, so I'm just gonna leave it at that. And this is Gus Greenfield. I approve this message. Fuck you, Chuck. <laughs>